opening with the king's pawn controls the center and opens up the light squared bishop and queen, often leading to sharp games. In the Karo can defense, c6 supports a quick d7 d5 pawn push to control the center and challenge the e4 pawn. d4 grabs control of the center and attacks the e5 and c5 squares. d5 controls the center and attacks the e4 pawn. e5 closes the center and controls the important d6 and f6 squares. bf5 develops the bishop where it controls the important e4 square, black can play e7 e6 next without trapping the light squared bishop on c8. g4 attacks the f5 bishop. It is the last book move. This moves the bishop to safety. It is best. This threatens to win a bishop. It is an inaccuracy. This is the only move that works. This stops the opponent from being able to win a bishop. It is a great move. This is a fair move. It is good. This activates a queen by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Takes back. It is best. A solid choice. It is excellent. This overlooks a better way to prepare a bishop for development. It is a mistake. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. It is best. After all captures, this is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. This threatens to kick a queen. There was only one good move in that position. This overlooks an opportunity to develop a knight off its starting square. It is a mistake. This activates a knight by developing it off of its starting square. This prevents the opponent from being able to kick a queen. It is best. This overlooks an opportunity to offer an equal trade of pieces. This permits the opponent to develop a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. It is a mistake. This develops a piece while also winning a tempo on a queen. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This ignores a better way to offer an equal trade of pieces. It is an inaccuracy. Castling gets the king to a safer square out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling queenside tends to be more active because the rook is closer to the center. It is best. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling to the same side of the board as the opponent avoids some of the attacking associated with opposite side castling. It is good. This attacks a queen, winning a tempo when it moves away. It is best. This move puts the queen on a safer square. This threatens to kick a queen. It is excellent. This wins time by threatening a queen and forcing it to move away. It is best. This moves the queen to safety. It is best. That pawn was free for the taking. It is best. This wins time by threatening a knight and forcing it to move away. It is good. That was a truly amazing move. It is brilliant. That was a free rook. It is excellent. Takes back. It is best. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This offers an equal trade of pieces. It is excellent. This is an equal trade. It is best. Recaptures. It is best. That's a sensible reply. It is excellent. This is the way to win a rook. It is best. This evades the check from the bishop. It is best. This forks pieces by creating a simultaneous attack. It is best. This defends a vulnerable rook by pinning one of its attackers. It is excellent. That was a free pawn. It is best. 